Hey guys, it's the Star Wars Vet. I'm back again. I know, you know, I was in retirement there from YouTube for a while. Well, there's so much going on that I have to come out of YouTube retirement. And I, there's so much news as far as Star Wars, our pop culture, what's going on in the world right now that, you know, I can't stay silent any longer. And today's video, it's going to have nothing to do with pop culture and it's definitely not going to have anything to do with Star Wars today. Um, this is a big issue and I think every last one of us needs to wrap our heads around what I'm about to cover today. Um, this past weekend we had the Straight Pride Parade. Okay, Antifa showed up at the Straight Pride Parade. 34 of them arrested. They crossed state lines to come and protest the Straight Pride Parade. They got violent. And this is where I really draw the line. They got violent with the police. Our men in blue, our men in black, that protect and serve every single damn day. They wear the badge. They're not there to harm people. They're there to actually protect and serve and they got in altercations with the police well 34 of them actually get arrested and they get put in jail thank god thank god you know they're actually put in jail and this is where the problem lies so for you people that live in new york shame on you shame on you you've actually elected a congressman aoc this little, I know it's YouTube, I gotta watch my language. She's raising money to bail these people out of jail. These, these domestic terrorists. She's actually raising money to bail them out of jail. And for all you people that elected her, you deserve her. You absolutely deserve this little whiny, racist, well, everything's racist now, according to her. The electorials, college is racist. White rice is racist. Milk is racist. You know, anything that's white now is racist. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of this PC culture. I'm sick of everything having to be polit politically correct. I'm done with it. I'm just absolutely done with it. And I do believe that we are coming to a point in America where we are going to have a culture war or some form of civil war against these stupid leftists, you know, trying to push this narrative and this I, stupid ass damn ideology down our throat. And I'm sorry. I know I'm usually calm, but I can't take it anymore. I can't take these idiots anymore. Even worse about it, it's pushed into our pop culture. Everything we love, our Star Wars, gone. MCU, gone. They just continue and continue and continue to just shove it down our throats. You know, for those people know me, I'm a man of faith. I believe in the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. And day in and day out, it's getting harder and harder and harder to actually turn the other cheek and forgive because this is getting to be so bad day in and day out and I never ever ever ask this of anybody I never ask anybody to share my videos at all because I'm not trying to make a name for myself I'm not trying to make a brand you know I get on YouTube you know as something I love to do when I do actually get on YouTube um, I've met a lot of great people through YouTube and I say thank God for that but for once, I'm going to ask, please, take this video and share it. People around the nation need to know what's going on. AOC needs to be put into her place. The squad needs to be put into their place. Because not only is AOC doing it, she has the full backing of Tlaib, Omar, and Presley. All four of them, they are backing her 100% to raise bail money for these idiots that would attack police and attack innocent people in a peaceful demonstration. 
these people need to be stopped. You know, I, I would like to see Antifa try that where I live right now. And come on down. I'll tell you right now, I live in Panama City, Florida. You know, I'll hold a protest out there somewhere, and I'll invite you, Antifa, to show up. I dare anybody with black masks to come and try to stop any bit of protest that we might stop. Every darn redneck in the woods will come out of the woods and put you in your place. And I'm going to leave it at that right now because I'm not about to make any threats. But don't try to pull that crap here. You know, all you little soy boys drinking your soy milk, your lattes, and, you know, calling yourself a male feminist, your day's done. Your day is done. America is tired of it. We're tired of it. And as far as I'm concerned, you know, get the hell out. You know, I, I hope President Trump, you know, labels you guys an actually domestic terrorist group. And whenever you do go out with your black mask on, they arrest you on the spot. Anyways, guys, I'm sorry. I know, you know, I'm, um, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, guys, but no, I'm not sorry. It's, it's time we quit bowing the knee to these liberal weirdos out there and we actually start making a stand. Anyways, guys, I am the Star Wars Dad. If you like my video, please hit that subscribe button, ring the notification bell so that you get some content when I actually put it out. And all of you, y'all have a nice night, all right?